All right, good morning, Facebook family. I uh, just wanted to uh, take a minute and kind of show you guys what I've been working on. I tried to do a Facebook Live the other day. I don't know, uh, well, I do know it didn't work out very well. I'm not sure why, I don't know what the problem was, but um, you've been seeing a lot of posts here lately of the uh, Cleburne County Library mural that I'm working on, and hopefully you can see uh, most of it there in the background. We got quite a few uh, sections that I'm gonna be adding here pretty soon. Um, I wanted to take a minute and kind of show you the process. Uh, you probably saw the post uh, a couple days ago that had the doodle grid system that, I, that I've been working with. And uh, I kind of talked about how to do that, but again, I want to kind of show you, sorry about the sun there. Um, I want to kind of show you the process. So uh, iPad here, let's see, let me get logged in. Everybody see the password to get in there? Um, let's see. Oh, I see my Florida family chiming in there. All right, so this is how I start out. This is the wall. Um, this is called the doodle grid system. And like I said, I got a post a couple of days ago that, that kind of explained this whole process, but I really want to show you how to do it. Um, I had uh, the beautiful Stephanie White, my wife, and the boy do a whole bunch of shapes on this wall. And this is going to be the basis of my doodle grid. Basically, all you do is you take this section here, and so I'm going to be working from, you can see this circle right here, um, over to this little circle right here. And that's really the thought process of how this whole thing works. Whenever I'm drawing the lines out and be like, oh, okay, from this circle to between these two hearts is a line, and around this cloud, you know, that's a line. So um, that's, that's basically how this whole thing works. But I'm going to walk you through it on the iPad. So got the wall took a picture of that and brought it onto my iPad. So we are now looking at the iPad. And again, we see this circle over to this circle, okay? This particular section, it's a, it's a skinny, it's a, it's a short skinny wall that's, that's kind of, uh, it's long width wise. So I, I was trying to find something to put in there. Um, I had a gentleman referee um, or recommend the Very Hungry Caterpillar, very popular children's book. Probably something that, that a lot of people are going to recognize, especially a lot of the kids are going to recognize. So I got on Google and I found the image. Turn the opacity up there so you can see it. And I just dragged it in and dropped it over my wall, right? What I do then is on my iPad, I just, I lower the opacity and you can see it kind of fade in and out there. I lower the opacity to where I can see the wall behind it. Um, and then I start another layer. And I'm just gonna show you real quickly, but I zoom in and I just kind of start tracing on this other layer, right? I'm trying to hold the phone in one hand and, and sketch with the other, so y'all just bear with me. And so basically that's what I do. I trace this whole thing out just like that, right? But whenever I do that, I end up with this line drawing, okay? Now you can see this one's facing the opposite way of this particular wall and this particular design. I'm actually flipping the design. So once I get it traced out, I remove the image underneath, and now I have this line drawing. And you can see it goes from, again, our circle here over to our circle here. So now what I'm gonna do is try my best to prop the phone up to where you guys can see. And please, uh, I'll check the phone periodically, but if you guys can let me know if it's not working. Hopefully you can see that other little circle there. But I'm gonna step away to the wall for just a minute and uh, kind of show you guys how this whole process works.
if I have any comments on there, you guys just let me know. Uh, make sure it's uh, make sure it's working for you. But you can kind of see. Uh, you're not gonna be able to see it too well, are you? But that's the the sketch, and basically what I'm doing is just using each one of these shapes that I have on the wall. Basically, I can go from that L to that smiley face down to that heart. Uh, over to that square, you know, just that's the that's, that's the mindset and the process that I use. What's that? Oh man, I'm trying, I'm trying. Oh, I appreciate it. Check and see how that's looking for you guys there. Miss Sandy, I appreciate the comment.
and there you go you can kind of see hopefully the, the light will adjust a little bit you can see the sketch and then just using that doodle grid system it just allows me to keep my proportion sketch it out not lose any of the quality going from going from paper to the wall so that's it i appreciate you guys watching i'll get this colored in and i'll post some pictures this afternoon thanks for watching